Uh, working our way right down here, we have measure. So our first tool will be the distance. So let's say it's, and these are all very easy, so I'm just gonna breeze by it, but let's say we're just doing this wall. Boom, 87 feet, uh, oops. And that is added, and then let's keep going. We'll do this whole wall, and that is 190. Um, very simple, let's go down to angle. Um, I think this would be a good example down here. Oops, I did it again. So that was 90 degrees, 90. Um, this next is area. So this is where we draw over an area. So let's actually use this and let's say we were just checking out these. And boom. All right, so moving right along, we have a pick area. Now this one's a little bit simpler because all we have to do is tap and it does it for us, very easy. And then finally again is select boundary where we can tap all of the walls and have it filled in. So that's measure for you. The last thing I'll show you here today um, is how to add your measurements along the entire drawing. So let's go ahead and delete these first. We'll use our select tool, select everything, and we're just going to add dimensions. Let's add it on the center and boom. So in case you wanted to have everything measured out without going through and actually measuring it yourself, that's a little bit of a faster way to do it.